Hey guys, it's Nate, aka The Foot Accountant. Welcome back to the channel. And we need to talk about the market today with what came out. First of all though, I wanted to enter FIFA Ultimate Team. I just downloaded the new update, the new patch and pitch notes, whatever they're gonna do uh, today. And I wanna do kind of a market talk video. I know there's a lot of people opening rewards right now. It is Thursday. I'm recording this just before uh, rewards do come out. So. I don't have rewards yet for you guys. I'll be doing those on stream later tonight. Uh, my Twitch link is below in the description. I do stream there. But I want to talk about what happened today on FIFA Ultimate Team. Um, and of course, show you guys who you should have voted for for this player pick SBC. Perisic, the main man. That's who we're voting for. We would love to see a Perisic card for footies. It's going to be a nasty, nasty card. So... Basically, what my video was about yesterday, you you guys probably saw. I mentioned the uh, team of the week SBCs coming out into the game. They were put in the code, and a lot of times when we see stuff put in the code like this. That stuff comes within the next 24 hours. These SBCs followed suit. They came out today, and I am very happy with EA and the requirements. Uh, that they are asking for these SBCs. The untradeable 81 plus SBC costs you about 16,000 coins, which is crazy to me. This is an 81 rated squad and it costs you 14, 15, 16,000 coins to do one of them. This should be so cheap um, that it's unreal. And this is out for two weeks. This SBC is out for two weeks. Crazy, crazy stuff um, that this SBC is out for so long. But as always, and I'm going to talk about this a little bit more today, the first couple of days when the SBC comes out, that is when everything is the most popular. It's the same with every promo. The first couple of days when a big SBC drops, it is repeatable. The first couple of days are, you know, the most hype and people are doing these SBCs the most. So we're going to talk about that today. But this untradeable 81 plus is about 16,000 coins to do. The 84 plus from scratch is around 40,000 coins. And it, all you need is an 83 rated squad and 20 chemistry. So literally, you can go buy the cheapest 83 rated players on the market to do this SBC. But that's the catch. That's why this SBC is 40k. Because look how cheap, or look how expensive, excuse me. They're not cheap, they're expensive. Look how expensive these cards are. 4,000 coins plus for all of these 83 rated cards that you need for this team. And even 82s are somewhere around 2,000 coins and above. It is crazy. It is ridiculous. Everybody is doing these packs right now. And let me say, I, you know, yeah, I think it's good. It's the end of the game. Do a few of them. Do a few of them. It's really good they put this SBC out. I figured they were going to have to release something to do with Team of the Weeks because Team of the Week cards were so, so high from everybody having coins after Team of the Season from Weekend League Rewards. Everybody had coins. They wanted to do Icon SBCs with those coins and they're having to pay buku dollars for for some of the informs that you need for a lot of these icons um, in their SBCs. Uh, and that just caused those uh, team of the weeks to go up and up and up. And especially since we weren't getting informs in the actual team of the weeks that were coming in midweek, um, these last couple of weeks, there was no supply for the higher rated cards. So I'm really glad that EA put these out. And I wanna talk about a few things regarding these SBCs because these SBCs absolutely changed the market like crazy today in terms of SBC prices and SBC, basically just SBC everything, man. I want to show you guys a couple things related to these SBCs on the market. First of all, I do want to take a look at, um, I want to take a look at this Icon SBC, the main man, uh, R9. This is like, why are we looking at an Icon SBC? This is the R9. 96 Ronaldo Icon SBC requires a lot of informs. Look what happened today when the informs dropped on the game. 6 p.m. UK, he's about 3.5, 3.7 million coins earlier in the day, almost 3.8. This is when high rated golds are pretty low. You know, they're up a tiny bit for the Bale SBC. Look what happens right at 6 p.m. Uh, UK. Boom. The SBC instantly drops 200,000 coins. It's come back up a little bit since then. But the SBC instantly drops to 3.3 mil because of the inform prices going down. And that happened with a lot of Icon SBCs today. A lot of these SBCs that people are gonna to wanna to do, I bet their prices, oh my gosh, look at Eusebio. 2.1 mil, all the way down to 1.8 million coins, 1.775. So you saved yourself 400,000 coins almost 
on some of these SBCs today if you completed them in that time frame just because these informs are so low. And a lot of people have untradeable informs now, um, basically because these cards are coming onto the market so frequently and so often, it's a weird dynamic to see 81 rated informs are 16, 17,000 coins. 82s are around 16, some of them are at 20K. The 83s are at 30K because these aren't getting supplied. These aren't getting supplied tradable like these are. Look at the 84s and the 85s and the 86s even. Orban, 13,000 coins for an 86 rated player. If you want to do, or if you think you're going to do, any Icon SBC or any big SBC throughout the rest of the year that could require informs, absolutely go out and get yourself some of these cards. Do a club stock of the icons because if it if it is in your desire to do any of these big time SBCs, Ronaldinho, uh, Vieira, Hullet, Eusebio, any of these big time icons that require um, Team of the Week cards, I want to do Maldini. He requires Team of the Week cards through and through. I'm going to have to do a club stock on some of the, even that 86 rated inform cards in here. Um, shoot, I can get an 87 rated Dabber or a Witzel 87 rated inform for 22,000 coins. For 22,000 coins. Crazy. Do a club stock with these cards. I'm serious. These cards are going to continue to rise after this. Yes, these cards will still be in SBCs. Yes, these cards will still be there for you to pack. But the supply on them is crazy now because a ton of people did SBCs right away. And people are going to continue to do those. And they're going to go out and buy the players. Because why do the SBC that costs you 40,000 coins, if we go back here to active challenges, this tradable SBC to do from scratch costs you 40,000 coins. This is one of the biggest EA scams and hustles I have seen to date so far. You're paying 40,000 coins to do this tradable 84 plus team of the week pack. You know what? Let's take a look at this. How many informs right now are over 40,000 coins? Let's go to gold inform. We're going to sort by price. All right. We're going to sort by price. How many of them are over 40,000 coins? We have 30 pages of gold informs. So you're making your money back on, this is the fourth page. Look at this, we're on the fifth page. Oh my gosh, dude. Let's go to page seven. Look at all these cards at 50K. Page 10. So you have a one in three chance of making your coins back on these cards. There's 30 pages of gold informs in this game. I understand there's some that are less than that are eight, less than 84 rated, but the op, you know the ability for you to make your coins back on this SBC is so so little. You're going to pack all of these guys, the 84s, the 85s, the 86s, even the 89s, like the summers, 34,000 coins. You pack that card, you're thinking, "Oh, shoot, I'm getting an 89 rated inform." He's 34k. Yes, it is a tradable card. That's the reason why all these card prices just absolutely died um but nobody's packing these big guys up here a few of them are i've seen a few of them enter the market today but really what you're seeing is a lot of these guys that like this pogba card i, I looked at him just a little bit ago and i mentioned him yesterday in my video watch some of these top rated cards that are in forms if you have them in your team uh and you want to or if you want to get them in your team watch for the panic selling before the sbc drops Look what happened with this 90 Pogba today. 335, he's down here at 310,000 coins. The SBC comes out then, boom, look what happens. He's right back up to 350, 359,000 coins where he currently is. So he went down 50,000 coins today to 310. He's now back up at 360. Crazy stuff like that, that's always going to happen. That's been the, the name of the game this year with cards like this is the panic sell before the SBC coming out because people think they're going to be able to pack that card via the SBC. Van Dijk at 228 rises back up to 260. Not too much movement with that card. He's got plenty of other special cards in the game, though. What about Conte? This is a popular card in the game for sure. He's already been in packs, though. But look what happened today. Panic sold down to 142, right back up to 180. 40,000 coin, boom, boom. Just like that. Easy way to make flight. You would have made over 30,000 coins if you flip that card today on that one card. So that's gonna, that happened with the higher rated stuff. If you were able to flip some of those cards, GG. But the message for most of us is if you plan to do SBCs, any SBC that they release for the rest of the year, get prepared now. Go out and do a club stock of these cards, especially after rewards. People are going to be having coins to do some more of these SBCs that they want to try them out and get a few cards. And 
you know, I would get these cards sooner rather than later because every single day that passes, people are going to realize these cards are cheap. They're going to go out. They're going to start doing icon SBCs with a lot of these cards. So do a club stock, 84, 85, 86, 87, even some of the 88 rated cards. That might be a bit high. Uh, but use mostly these 84s, 85s, and 86s because those are going to be used the most in some of these icon SBC. So that was a crazy, crazy market movement today. Just all those informs basically killing the market, like the, the price of some of these cards on the market. I'm actually going to go through and pick up some of these informs right now. I realized some of these prices were actually lower in the, the most hype part of the day. Um, like daily blend right now. What is he at? Is he not at 12K? Where is he at? Is he 14? All right, 14,000 coins for that daily blend card. He's on the top of Footbin though, so everybody's seeing that he's cheap. What about Pellegrini? What about Pellegrini? 14,000 coins. So you can get these cards on Snipes. Um, I want Milik. You can get these cards from just searching around the transfer market. Basically, just go to Footbin like I am right here. Look for some of these cards and see which ones are the cheapest and just stock your club, man. Just stock your club because there's going to be more SBCs that are coming out. I mean, they're doing all of these best of SBCs for the entirety of the year. Um, and it, this is a, it's an insane uh, way to stock your club and to invest in these cards, in my opinion. Just to get some of these cards. Is this real? Is he going to 85 rated? 14,000 coins. What about Glick? Glick is the SBC monster. Nah. Down here, like 15K, maybe? 16,500. Wait till more. Uh, right now, it's nighttime NA. Wait until there's a lot of people on the game again on Thursday after rewards. There'll be a lot more people um, working on these SBCs again. That's my advice to you guys for these. I would get on those. Um, again, if you have gold cards, if you want to do a few of these SBCs, I honestly might recommend to you the 81 plus. I really might recommend to you the 81 plus SBC because it only costs you 16,000 coins and that price is going to go down a bunch. I bet that price gets to under 10,000 coins easily here in the next couple of days uh, just because you will need an 81 overall team and uh, those cards will easily get under 1k as they get packed from weekend league rewards and the hype dies down for these SBCs. Even though you're thinking, yo, dude, 84 rated? I mean, I need an 83 rated squad. The only way that this will get cheap again is if they release a repeatable... Um, SBC like an 81 plus or an 82 plus that's when these will get um, doable again and these are out for 14 days so that is huge um, EA is really trying to save this footies promo after we basically had no content on Sunday little to no content on Monday we get the UCL premium upgrades that we were kind of confused about they're okay and now back to back days um, we get we get some good content so I'm pretty happy about that I'm pretty happy with the content they've been dropping so far the last couple of days. I'm glad to see some of the stuff is coming out. Um, the footies voting day, I need to do, to do that SBC as well. But I basically just wanted to hop on a video today and talk with you guys about some of these crazy, crazy market movements. And I'm going to keep looking through some of these informs to uh, find some that I can put in the club. But again, basically just look through these cards um, when during the middle of the day when there's a lot of stuff going on because... People are still doing these SBCs, and you know I'm sure a lot of people today realized that uh, that these SBCs are not really worth it. They, these SBCs are a scam. I'm going to be honest; they really are a scam for the, uh, coming from the fact that um, they just you're paying forty thousand coins to do the tradable eighty-four rated SBC, and in return you're mostly getting cards that are thirteen, fourteen, fifteen thousand coins. Uh, yes, they're fun to do. I'm going to be doing a couple on stream um, when you guys can watch and have fun with me doing them. But still, um, basically the only reason why I do them is to get them in the club to do Icon SBCs at a discounted price. So one other thing that I want to mention is since you'll be able to discard, or not discard, once you'll be able to stock up on some of these informs, um, some of these informs that you want in your team, after that, the high rated golds are going to drop at some point again as well. Whether we get repeatable packs, whether we get, um, you know, all, all sorts of stuff that we could get from uh, these packs, whatever SBCs that they put out, there's going to be another drop for the high rated gold cards, 85, 86, 87, all the way up. They're decently low right now, 
But once those cards drop again, uh, you're going to see Icon SBC prices go crazy, crazy low. So if you stock up on the informs now, you'll be saving some coins on the informs there. And then again, you'll be saving coins as the higher rated cards um, drop, depending on what other content that EA puts out. But again, this is another smart move by EA. They're putting out content like this. Um, they're getting people to put their coins into these SBCs. And they're getting people to do it when they are very high in price as well. And you have to pay a lot of coins for some of these cards. 15K for an 85 rated inform. These informs are usually 25 to 30K on the market. Crazy, crazy prices. One that I really want to find out here is this guy on the market for really cheap. Weghorst, how much is he? Is he like 17K? Oh yes, 17,750. I'm going to buy a couple of those because 86 is a great rating uh, for some of these SBCs. Even a guy like DeVry. Is he, what is he going for right now? What is this in format? 19,250. That's a crazy price for some of these cards as well. Again, focus on some of the cards that get good links that have good uh, nationalities that link together for these SBCs, they're going to rise, honestly. They're going to be rising because they just got way too low today for the good of the market, and especially with all these Icon SBCs and the amount of coins that are on the game this year. Um, watch some to, for some of these cards to go up. Now, if you want to do an Icon SBC, as you saw when we looked at Flippin', a lot of these, uh, the prices of these SBCs have dropped, so it wouldn't be a bad time to start shipping away at an Icon SBC to start going for one of those if that is something that you do uh, want to do. So thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, smash a thumbs up. And uh, we're going to be hitting some rewards tonight on the Twitch channel. So again, hit that link in the description below. If you have any questions as well, I'll be active in the comments. Hit me up there. I know FIFA is kind of coming to an end. And I know I say this all the time. We're going to be doing some more content stuff. But right now, um, there's still a lot of stuff to do on the game. And I really want to help you guys get prepared for whatever you're doing. Icon SBCs. Um, saving you some coins by telling you to get rid of your informs, which I hopefully, hopefully you guys got rid of your informs uh, before today in the market crash um, and all of that. So I'm just here to help you guys out, and that's what I enjoy doing the most on FIFA Ultimate Team. It's been your boy Nate, the photo count. Catch you guys later. Peace out.